Why should caring for the planet start from the ground? When sustainably managed, soil is one of our best allies to eradicate hunger, fight climate change, end poverty, provide clean water, preserve biodiversity, adapt to changing weather patterns and improve drought response, improve livelihoods, minimize pollution, increase resilience to environmental crises. Why is soil organic carbon so important? The world's soils act as a carbon sink, reducing greenhouse gases in the atmosphere. One third of soils are degraded. Restoring these soils can remove up to 51 gigatons of carbon from the atmosphere and contribute to the fight against climate change. Demand for food will grow by 49% between 2012 and 2050, meaning agriculture will have to become more productive to nourish the whole planet and meet the sustainable development goals. We therefore need fertile soils. Healthy soil with an ideal amount of soil organic carbon provides optimal growing conditions, good nutrient cycling, and effective water infiltration and storage. Increasing soil organic carbon by improved management can raise food production by 17.6 megatons per year and help maintain productivity in drier conditions. How easy is it to measure carbon in the soil? Measuring soil organic carbon, SOC, is labor-intensive and expensive, involving sampling and lab analysis. Most countries do not have national soil information systems and can, at best, provide only a rough estimate of the distribution of soil organic carbon. Different methodologies make it challenging to compare soil organic carbon reports from different sources or countries. This is why a global soil information system, GLOSSIS, will be established. Its first product will be the Global Soil Organic Carbon Map, GSOC Map. How does the GSOC Map contribute to caring for the planet? The GSOC Map is also a comprehensive process that supports the development of national capacities to build their national soil information systems. The GSOC Map is the first global soil map ever produced using a distributed data collection effort. It depicts the biggest effort to date in compiling a country-driven global soil organic carbon map. The GSOC map constitutes the basis for moving into both baseline and monitoring systems to support evidence-based decision-making. It allows countries to identify degraded areas and set restoration targets, increasing the chances of meeting the world's growing need for food and achieving the goals of the 2030 Agenda for Sustainable Development. What's next? The GSOC map, launched on World Soil Day 2017, paves the way for monitoring soil organic carbon stocks and thus the state of health of our soils. The first step for caring is knowing and sharing the information. Many countries have now recognized the importance and potential of soils in tackling global environmental challenges. 85% of land cover is now mapped with best available national soil organic carbon data. The Global Soil Partnership will support countries, monitor soil health, and promote on-the-ground implementation of sustainable soil management. Knowing our soils will help us manage them in a sustainable way, unlock their potential for mitigating and adapting to climate change, and ensure sufficient food production for present and future generations. Caring for the planet starts from the ground.